So you might be in this really random situation where for some reason your Android phone is just not discovering any USB accessories that you're plugging inside of it. Now this can happen for a couple of different reasons. There's never just one reason why something like this ends up happening. The very first thing you're going to want to do though is you want to go and take a close look at the bottom of that USB port that you're plugging in accessories into. The first thing you're going to want to do is you want to go and clean out that particular port or see if there's any issues going on within that port that you basically have. For a lot of people, that's probably all you're going to have to do is just to double check that particular port and make sure that that port is cleaned out. Now, the next thing you want to do is you want to make sure that accessory that you're plugging into inside of your phone, you want to make sure that accessory is also fully compatible with your particular device. There could be lots of times that you're going through and you're you know, plugging in different accessories into your phone, but for some reason, those accessories are not working. So all you're going to have to do here is just make sure those accessories are supported on your phone. And that's another thing you may want to try doing as well. Now, depending on the accessory, let's say it's like a USB drive or something like that. The other thing you can try doing is making your way over into your files application of your Android phone and seeing if those particular files are able to you know, be brought up inside of your phone panel here. If it's like a USB drive, if it's an external drive, anything like that, you may have to just make your way over to your Android phone settings like right here. That's probably all you're going to have to do. And then you'll be able to discover those particular you know, files or those things that you want to see. And that's another thing you can do to end up fixing this problem as well. Now, if that's still not working, what you can also try doing is seeing if there's an update available for your phone. So make your way over into your Android settings, which is right here. Scroll down until you see software update or like, you know, system or anything like that. Go and scroll down again, click on system update and see if you can update your system. And that's another thing you can do to end up fixing this problem as well. So those are kind of the main ways to go and fix it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.